let's hope Blake. that um, it'll be a great match and yeah for once uh, just oh. think I'll go with the Danish side in, in this match here and uh, I'll apologize for, for being a little bit Welcome to the mid-game interval. We've only had five minutes. And we're already at the mid-game interval. 11 6 to the scoreline. And how much do you think the influence of their only previous encounter is maybe going to affect today's final? Well, I think we've got quite a lot of respect for the Indonesians, and, and rightly so. Um, they. Um, They've had some difficulties with Asan playing with the uh, different partners. Uh, they yeah. played as point situations, rallies that you could write in your book. Okay. Uh, so what do Danish coaches have to try and turn this around? Mumbai, Mohammed Asan, Hendra Sengar 21-13. 21-13 confirms Bert van Horenbeck of oh, Belgium, the umpire. And quite frankly, after 11 minutes, rushing through and in total control of that open game, the number six seeds, Mohamed Hassan, and for the Danish coaches, it was oh, service fault called at the waist. What on earth do the coaches work on with the Danes? Oh, that was going out. Uh, it was taken by the Indonesians. Uh, it means that the Danes have a one-point advantage here in the second half. We've only had 20 minutes of this match, and we've obviously already had three minutes of timeout. For the Indonesians. Good serve. <laughs> lasting more than 35 minutes the final was 32 minutes 21 13 23 21 and disappointment for the Danes but in all honesty Steen the Indonesians were better today the Indonesians were sharp they played the right game and they deserve the title So a second world title for Indonesia at these World Championships. <laughs> Indonesian coach applauds. First final we've had that hasn't gone the full distance. Absolute delight for the Indonesians. I think Mohamed Hassan nice to see. I have a feeling that he'll, he's asking them if they want to play another game afterwards. 